カーメイハーメイガムガムロウハージェットピットラー Why you know work? What's up everybody from Never World here today to talk about the two trailers that were recently released for One Piece Kazuku Muso English release as well as DBZ Connect for the Xbox 360. Let's start off with DBZ for the Connect since this is something that is more relatively new rather than、uh, Pirate Warriors that already has been talked about quite a bit. Alright, so DBZ Connect is exclusively for the Xbox 360 and is basically gonna be a motion censored DBZ game where like if you use your hands you can make a Kamehameha on the screen. But based off the trailer, it looked so corny. I mean, the guy is like throwing punches and stuff, and I don't know, to me it just looks so corny. Like, the average person that would. Pick this game up, you know, just the average gamer, I guess you'd say, would say something along the lines of, yo, dog, this game ain't got no swag, bruh. It just looks so corny. And to be honest as well, DBZ Ultimate Tenkaichi left a bad taste in my mouth for DBZ game because I was really hyped for that game and it turned out to be, you know, kind of a bit lackluster with a lot of things. So I'm really not. At all looking forward to this game, and I probably won't pick it up. Although I have a 360, I don't have a Kinect, and I would not pick up a Kinect just for this game because, based off the trailer, it doesn't look impressive at all. And don't get me wrong, I'm the type of person that I will go all out for something I love. Like, you know, I love Dragon Ball Z and One Piece, and if it looked impressive, I would go out immediately and get a Kinect just so that I could play this game. But the trailer just showed it, and it looked so corny. I was just like, What is this? Am I looking at this? Just looks like, in a way, it kind of looked a little bit like Ultimate Tenkaichi,、um, as far as like graphics wise, but it just looked like. Subpar. I don't even think it's coming out in Japan, which is even more funny. And overall, I'm just not really excited for it. But if you are, that's cool for you. If you're gonna go pick it up, if you have a Connect, this is definitely one game I would say if you do have a Connect and you wanna pick up some games for it to probably pick up because, you know, after all, it is Dragon Ball Z. And if you're a fan of it, then. You know, gives you a reason to buy something for the Kinect. Yeah, this is probably one DBZ game I will never own in my entire life. On to One Piece. As some of you may know, it was recently announced that One Piece Kaizuku Muso, also known as Pirate Warriors, is coming to the US and Europe, but it's gonna be a digital download only, I believe. Which is very lackluster, in my opinion, because this is a very huge game. I believe it sold like well over half a million copies in its first week in Japan, and it was doing phenomenal in Japan, so I don't understand exactly why they would. Be this, like, you know, okay, it's awesome, they're bringing it, but as a digital download only? At least in Europe, they could have put a hard copy because I know One Piece in Europe does well, so, you know, why not? And then based off this trailer, there's not even gonna be an English dub. Don't get me wrong, I'm not a huge fan of the One Piece dub, I prefer the sub a million times. However, I do think a game would be more complete if it did have a dub on it. And it just seems like they have no faith whatsoever behind this game when it comes to releasing it in the US and Europe, like, almost as if they're expecting it to flop or sell poorly. Nonetheless, Less, don't get me wrong, I am grateful they did not have to release this whatsoever with subtitles in Europe and America, but I just think that. They need to have a little more faith in a game of a series that is humongous in Japan and is slowly but surely becoming a lot bigger around the world. But let me know what you guys think about these two trailers and these two games, DBZ Connect and One Piece Pirate Warriors. Are you excited for them? Are you going to be、uh, getting your digital download on with Pirate Warriors? And if you have a Connect, are you going to be picking up DBZ Connect? And if you don't have a Connect, are you going to buy it just for this game? Let me know in the comment section below or with a video response. Give me your thoughts on the trailers and these two upcoming games, One Piece Pirate Warriors and DBZ Connect. Connect. But that's all I have for you guys today. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Thumbs up for Dragon Ball Z and One Piece. Let's face it, these games aren't getting the proper treatment they deserve. I'm Fenebra World, and as always, people, have an awesome day.